AFTV back in the building good for luck. a win. The good luck charm. Me, I know they can play. Me, I know they for my, my energy is high. What the fuck? Me, I know they me, I know they for my, my energy is high. What the fuck? Hey, what on the night? Hey, Robbie, let's go. I tell you what, yeah. I tell you what, right? I'm so glad we won, yeah, because if you would have danced the night after we, if, if we would have lost that, I would have, I would have been done. I would have kicked it down and my, 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 I'm then you wouldn't be able to dance. I'm tonight. telling you, my punditry career self would have been over <laughs> because the lineup I got ten over eleven. I knew he was going to go so something similar. And I was just praying. I said, God, just deliver us. Please, my career is hanging in the balance. Because you know? I was probably standing alone during the analysis with Bellerin and everything. I'm like, God, please vindicate me. And he vindicated me and the boys. You know, we believed, you know. But I have to state the facts. Bukayo Saka is a generational talent. Yes. yes. That, that, for that's my interview done. That boy, under pressure, 90-something minutes, or 88 minutes or whatever, delivered an inch-perfect cross. Had two assists in this game. Man keeps getting better and better. Very humble boy, always willing to learn. I was, I'm even scared that he might even burn out. You know. The but point, the the point you pushing. make about the point you make, and I don't, I don't think you can, you know, oh. underestimate. As a young player, and you've got that ball there, and the clock is ticking down. Most young players, even with talent, are gonna think. Gonna if I, I put that ball in and, he, and I mess that up, yeah. all the senior players are going to be like, yo. Not even the senior players, but the fans yeah, at home. The fans at home, the manager. Yeah. But this kid's got no fear. No fear. No fear. He's got no fear. no fear. Puts in an inch perfect. I mean, the players today, there's a few players that have just dug us out of this. Bamiyang, Saka, Tierney. These guys rose above today, didn't they? Of course, of course. I'm um, Tierney, the, that goal and the timing was very important. Sure. He made us believe that we could come back. And got, you saw him after scoring. And, and then he was, yeah, exactly. He was. And it's a brilliant goal again. Brilliant. Uh, brilliant, brilliant. Goal. And you have to also shout out to William as well for picking at least the right ball. It's, mm. it's an assist, but not like the assist assists you, but it's time there's an assist. But he came but, on, and William, he and he affected the yeah, game. Yeah, he affected the game. He affected the game. So that's why you have to give credit to the manager. I know he's come under the coach for substitutions and everything. And I have to state that he did his substitution some of them very early, although it was in reaction to their goal, yes, but mm. at least he came in early. He and at the right side, away. yeah, straight away. So which is good. Pate, who hasn't played in weeks, came on and did his best as well. He, he played really well, you know. So I think uh, the boys, like you said, rose up to the occasion, you know. We panicked. We are at home, you know. I was asking oh. you whether I have pacemaker or defibrillator. I don't even know what to call it. I don't know. because <laughs> My heart was pounding, but I, I was appearing calm. But inside me, I'm like, God, please, rescue us. You know, this, this our season depends on this game. And uh, we, 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 we survived. It's and contrast to last season, because last season... The big moment we went out like that. Yeah, last week. Right, mm. but this time we reversed it, and it's kind of fitting that the guy who missed. remember at yeah, that game, yeah. the, it was a Bamian yeah, missed that, that big. He scored chance. that great overhead yeah. kick. They missed that big chance, chance right at the yeah. end. He gets the winner today. Of course, of course, he's been vindicated, like you said earlier in the live stream. You know, criticism from people like. Um, What's his name again? Jamie Redknapp. Jamie Redknapp. Redknapp that cannot even criticize his cousin, uh, <laughs> Frank Lampard. Mm. He's the one criticizing mm. somebody that is doing his job. You know, he it says a lot. He says a lot. And some of these pundits, I respect their opinion, but some of them, I don't, I don't understand what they're saying sometimes. They're giving mixed messages. Somebody has a bad game, then he has a bad game. It can happen in football. Mm. You know, you can, you can miss all the chances or you cannot even get into the game at all. You know, it happens in football. But you don't go three man them under the bus. You're a fellow professional. You should... Mm. Choose your words carefully, you know. And what he said about Bamayang, when you look at the statistics, it, it doesn't all go with what you're saying. Mm. That, that's wrong. I think he was in my And and and, and it's, the, it's the ability to score big goals, mm. big goals, and that was a big one. Of course, um, yeah, I, I can see why the manager started him. I know a lot of people were saying Lacazette, 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 but you can see the reason why he started clearly. clearly. Yeah, and that's what I went for because he plays off the shoulder. Most of his goals were off the shoulder. Mm. You understand? Once you get the perfect cross in, or the perfect pass, he gets it. He's quick. He has suppliers. Saka can supply. Odegaard can supply. Smidro can supply. So he's only just to run onto it and put it mm. back in. And he did it very well. Yes, I probably would have brought in maybe Lacazette earlier because he defends from the front. You know, he can occupy the defenders. But I think the manager was um, okay with the starting lineup and, you know, his substitutions worked as well. Who do you want in the next round? 
Somebody, so I don't know who has qualified. None of the English no, names? No, 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 not even English. <laughs> but I, I mean, I just think that this might help us build a bit of form, you know. We go to Leicester Sunday, early kickoff and everything. I think it will help us build a bit of form and the momentum. Uh, if we get somebody, sometimes, although sometimes we rise up to the occasion, you know. Yeah. When we played FA Cup last year, uh, look at them, all them, yeah. Liverpool and Man City and the rest, we rose up even, to the Even when we got to the final of the Europa League, that was a... You know, teams like Valencia yeah, and stuff yeah. like that. You know I mean? so, and the rest of them, yeah, I, yeah, I, so. I think so. Uh, yeah, I mean, we will rise up to the occasion. Anybody you bring, hopefully, I just pray that Pate stays fit. I think now we should kind of blood him in slowly because, you know, I don't want him to stop. Player. Big player. Big player, man. Big spider. The man, the man is everywhere. Mm. I wanted to blood him in gradually. Where they can give, where they can give Bukayo Saka a rest, they should wear. You know, let's say you go it's into too good, you can't risk <laughs> I know, but let's say rest him in June. <laughs> no, no, the Euros are in June. And he'd probably be playing no, in the Euros. Course, I mean, he's and it's just two weeks break. Yeah. You know, so that's the thing. When let's say you go into a game and you're leading three nil, four nil, six something, we can't just take him out like boy, sit down and rest. Because he needs a rest. He's although he's our best player, he's be rescuing us, but you don't want him to burn out. We're in the business end of the season now. Top six is still feasible. So many things are still feasible. We have, what, 14, 13 games mm. to go. So anything is feasible. If we're not Leicester. Leicester don't really play well at home. They play well away, better. And then <laughs> everything changes, you know. So, but I'm happy. I'm happy with the victory. I don't I'm lacking words. Thank you for recalling me in time. You know, I showed my <laughs> form. You, 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 you banned me, you, you banned you, me like Ozil. You banned me. Now, eh? Yes, you back 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 back. Back. <laughs> But um, I'm happy to be here. And uh, thank you, guys. Thank you for the win. I don't know what to say. Thank you. <laughs> Every week on AFTV Picks, we give away £1,000. And all you've got to do is enter our free-to-play competition and go head-to-head -to -head with me, win it, and uh, this could be yours. Get involved right now, click the link in the description, and you can play, and it's absolutely free. All you have to do is be over 18 and uh, have some decent football knowledge. So what are you waiting for? Get involved now, and you could win yourself £1,000.